right, all right. There we go. A little largemouth there. A little classic bass special. But we're gonna need about 30 of them to do any better. So I'm Brad Leiferman, pro angler with the Champions Tour. We're on the Mississippi River. Stop two, uh, Lake Pepin, Wabasha. And I'm gonna give you a few uh, uh, tips on how to fish the river. You know, uh, the river constantly changes. Number one thing on the river, you wanna wear a life jacket. It's like vital. Uh, at any time, there's gonna be logs, stumps. So please, wear a life jacket. But some of the lures, you'll see I got about 10 rods here. I try to keep my bait small. Uh, probably one of my go-tos for these smallmouth on rocks is a little number five shad wrap. It probably mimics uh, the bait fish better than any bait out there. And it's kind of a, always a bait that I can get bites on, especially when things are tough. Things you remember for river fishing, it's typically rocks, mud banks or cut banks, and uh, hardcover, like rocks and stumps, trees, stuff like that. Try to keep your bait small. That's really the key to the river fishing. And the smaller the river, the smaller the bait. So here on the Mississippi, typical baits uh, we have tied on. We do a Carolina rig with a little craw. We'll do a frog, you know, for fishing slop and lily pads. Typical swim jig. And I think you'll find with all the anglers that are fishing classic bass, we all pretty much use the same techniques, maybe a little bit of variation. But like I said, be safe. Use the right baits, keep them small, and you'll have success on the river.